Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Today we are back in the Highlands at Brentwood looking at this 1975 two bedroom, two bath, south wind. This is a 24 by 52. Uh, the gentleman that, uh, oh, one of our neighbors. Um, the gentleman that was living here uh, just moved into an independent care place. And so he's all moved out. This is available for immediate possession. And uh, just a really cute place. It's super hot day today. It's over 100 and it's gonna only get worse in the next couple months. But this is a pretty hot deal on a hot day. So this is the kitchen. Notice it does have the white cabinetry, which is really nice. Um, also the property's been updated with the uh, lighter painted interior walls, which is really nice. The carpets have just been clean. It does have that nice deluxe squishy carpet with the upgraded pad. You can see he's had a cat here and uh, he also made like a little cat exit out of the bedroom, um, which of course could be patched and somebody didn't need it. Uh, but it's got this nice uh, built-in china hutch, uh, formal dining room. All the furniture that you see here does stay here. I don't know if he's gonna take his cat gym with him or not. But it's got the gas range. Full-size washer and dryer, full overhead lighting there in the laundry area, and a broom closet. And a <clears throat> coat closet. You can see what color the paneling was before he had it painted. And this is the second bathroom. It does have that beautiful simulated marble. Oh, yes. A simulated marble lobby there. A little bunch of storage underneath, trifold medicine cabinet, tub and shower combination. It's got that harvest gold commode with the padded seat. Those are very comfortable. And then we go into the second bedroom. And he's taken all the furniture out of here, but it does have this sliding wardrobe here. Plenty big enough to fit um, at least a queen bed in here. And the master bedroom is really large also. He had this kind of as a combination uh, bedroom and office area. And I was questioning this air conditioning unit that he put in here. Um, I don't know if he just kept this on to keep the cat cool. <laughs> But it does have central air, so, you know, sometimes these people, they want to save money, so they'll just air condition one room. But um, I'll have to ask him about that. And then it has the little vanity here. Nice walk-in closet. And the master bath with that simulated marble again. Trifold medicine cabinet. Looks like this is a high-rise stool. It doesn't have the padded seat but oh well then you've got the safety grab bar and a walk-in shower so really great price on this place too um he's only asking 11.9 and he's very motivated to get it sold he obviously isn't going to be using it anymore and uh just a cute place um, i'm going to find out a little bit more about the specs as far as like how old the plumbing is and when the last time the roof was coated, but it does have this screen room as well. Oh, look, so the cat could just jump out there. Oh, it's a little cat house. Outside cat box. Oh, how smart is that? Well, if you have a cat, that's the perfect thing. And then uh, it's got that big air conditioner. And uh, one thing about the Highlands at Brentwood is they do allow fencing in this community. Um, you have to check with management for sure to find out how big and where and stuff, but that's kind of a nice feature if you have a pet and you want to put in a fenced uh, backyard. But this is a good size, pretty flat rear uh, area here. Nice screen room. I think they call those pineapple palms. 
They're a little fatter around the trunk. And this workshop is awesome too. I cannot find a key for it, but we do have photos of that. So um, that will be on our website at azactiveresorts.com. <clears throat> um, we'll include a picture of the shed on that. Or if you'd like one sooner, as soon as you see this video, I could also email you the pictures of the shed. But a really cute place, great price, ground set, light interior, squishy carpet, <laughs> and only 11900 So if you're interested in this property, the web reference number on this is BH292ME. It is available for immediate possession. I'm Kara. You can text me at 480-299-7236. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel, which is AZ Active Resorts DOT.com. Once you click subscribe, there'll be a little button, little window pop up that will ask you if you want notifications of new listings. If you click that, anytime we get a new video, um, you'll be notified as soon as it goes up. And we do post our videos before we post them on the uh, other website. So if you are a subscriber on our YouTube channel, you get first shot at our new listings. But uh, yeah, it's cute. Especially if you have a cat, this would be perfect. Okay, folks, well, thanks for tuning in. And as always, I very much appreciate you uh, taking a look at our listings. And uh, feel free to call us 1-800-478-3864 as well. All right, have a great day. Hi, Richard, it's Kara. Okay. Hi, okay, so normally what we do is when... The seller is present, we'll do a video interview because the buyers really enjoy hearing about the house from the seller, you know, because the seller knows a lot more than we do. And we also have a questionnaire that we normally have you complete. So I'm doing something a little bit new. I'm experimenting. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to record our conversation so that I can put that on with the video. And that way people can hear the answers to the questions that I ask you. Is that okay? Okay. All right, great. So how long have you owned the property? Uh, Ten years. Okay. And what brought you to Arizona or what brought you into the Highlands? Uh, oh, uh, well, I like the golf course and the gated community. Yeah. And and the house I uh, like very much. Yeah. That is a really cute place. I was in there yesterday, and they uh, they did the carpets, and they look really good. Yes. I was there yesterday. I was there uh, sure. yesterday. Yes. Okay. And is the fridge a frost-free fridge? I'm sorry. I... I'm sorry. Is the fridge frost-free? Yes. Okay. And then you got the gas range, and uh, I'm trying to see here from the pictures. I can't remember if there's a dishwasher. No dishwasher. No dishwasher. Okay. How old are the washer and dryer? Uh, I don't know. They were there when I bought the place 10 years ago. Okay. All right. And then um, the uh, furnace, is that a gas furnace? I'm sorry? Is the furnace a gas furnace? Uh, no. It's all on the AC. It's uh, outside. The air conditioning is, uh, uh, what do they call it, uh, heat or, or air. Okay, so is it a heat pump? Yeah. Okay. And then um, in your bedroom, there's a, a separate air conditioning unit. Um, I was just wondering why you have that in the bedroom. Well, I, I thought a good idea was to have an extra air conditioning just in case the big wind went out. The heat is intense in the summer, as you know. And uh, But I never used it. it. It was a good idea, but I never had to use it. Okay, all right. And then you got the little cat exit there. I thought that had a lot of ingenuity so the cat could go outside in its box. Yes. Okay. And then um, what other upgrades? When was the last time that you had the roof coated? Uh, that was painted a little bit uh, when I first moved in. Okay, so it hasn't been coated in 12 years? Uh, in 10 years. 10 years, okay, all right. And are there any improvements that you can think of that you've made to it, uh, replaced any toilets, anything like that? No, the only thing I did was screen in the porch, and I put new carpet in 10 years ago. Okay, all right. And uh, let's see, how, how old is the water heater, do you know? 
Uh, how much? I'm sorry. The water heater? Is that the one that was in there when you bought it too? Yes, yes. Okay. And uh, what about the plumbing? You've never had any plumbing leaks that you know of? No, everything seems to be good for the plumbing. All right. Is there anything that we haven't talked about that you think that would be important when a buyer's considering your property? Uh, no, other than uh, I'm sure you realize that everything I left there, they can have. Okay, good. And there are a bunch of tools in the storage room, but they can have that, all the tools in there. Okay, and you're not going to take your cat, Jim? Uh, you know, the, no. the, cat, the cat climbing thing? Oh, no, I'm not going to take that. Okay, all right. So, yeah, if somebody's got a cat, this is the perfect place. Even the cat Jim's there. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> <laughs> um, do you have a garbage disposal? No, no garbage disposal. Okay, all right. Well, I think that's it. If I have any more questions, I'll give you a call back, but we'll uh, get this on the Internet for you. Okay, that sounds great. All right, thank you. Have a good day. Okay, Carol. Right. Uh-huh, bye-bye. Bye-bye.